Samson of old or Austin here. I just briefly want to go live. Um, after speaking to my younger sister and my dad and my younger brothers who have suggested that I do this, I don't know how I feel about doing this, but I'm still going to be humble enough and try this out. I would like to seek investors to invest into something I would like to do. I love building gaming streaming computers, okay? But before I talk about this, I want to show you what I am capable of doing. And I take I take pride in my work and I'm re I really do enjoy hearing what people think. I really do hear I really do enjoy hearing how much people enjoy the computers I build for them. I've only built one computer for a friend and a brother in Christ. And I'm very humble by the kind things he has to say about what I was able to do for him. And I'll read you those in a minute, and then we'll talk about some stuff, okay? Sorry about the bad video quality. It was taken on his cell phone, so I do apologize for that. That is the part I built, that right there. The extra components are basically accessories. It's liquid cooled, as you can see. He's gonna go down further. It's got light up RAM, LED, RGB, a 240 millimeter liquid cooler. And it's a glass panel. Now, the CPU he is running, all right, is the Ryzen 9 5900X, the same CPU I have in my computer, okay, guys? Um, now, before we move on to this, I'm going to read you a comment from my brother Jeremy, but before I do that, well, we'll just go ahead and read you what my brother Jeremy said in the comment. Um, and then from there, we'll show you the video or show you the description of why I'm trying to do what I'm doing, okay? But I'm trying to build computers. Yes, I want to build computers. That is a desire that I have between doing the gaming videos and content creation, recording them and uploading them. I would like to build and sell computers. I would like to own my own business and I would like to build and sell computers, gaming, streaming computers. God be willing, and that is why I'm seeking investors, someone who is willing to help me. And I am seeking conservative investors who are willing to work with um, small content creators and people like myself who have autism, bipolar, OCD, PTSD, and a past traumatic brain injury, guys. I am very obsessive about what I do. I am very I have a perfectionist mentality in how I handle computers. Some days it can be frustrating. Some days it can get tiring, but I absolutely love building these, okay? Now, I'll just circle this so you all can see it. My friend Austin helped me with this custom build, and I couldn't be happier. He does great work and was available and very attentive to detail throughout the entire process. The system itself is the fastest I have ever owned, and every and everything was packed and shipped with... Meti I can't pronounce that word, God bless it. Meti meticulous care, and that's from my brother in Christ, Jeremy Stevens. Um, now again, guys, I have been humbled beyond belief. Every time I have gamed with my brother Jeremy, he has always been so kind. He has always complimented me. And it has always meant the world. And it, it's always made me want to cry because I finally found a skill that I have. I finally found something I'm good at. Something I'm good at that not a lot of people can do. Yeah, my younger brother can build one. My youngest brother, Caleb, can build a computer. My other brother, the veteran, my brother who's a veteran Marine, cannot build a computer. He doesn't know how. He's not very good at it. Um, he can play on a console, but he can't build computers. He can build cars. He can work in plumbing. 
he can well, but he doesn't know how to build computers. So I don't have many skills in life other than being a video gamer. Okay, I love video games with a passion. And I love building computers. I took, how do I word this right? I take great pride in what I was able to do here. And I'm so very thankful to my brother, Jeremy, for allowing me this opportunity to build this computer and allow him to be the first example of what I can do if people are willing to allow me to build them computers and whatnot. So my challenge and the challenge is that challenge that I'm issuing, all right, guys, is this, and I'm requesting it kindly. It's a challenge to those out there who are rich, who are rich and kind enough, and who are investors and would like to invest or maybe take take honest or may, maybe be cur maybe be curious about my invest or I stumbled over my words, guys. Forgive me. Who might be curious about what I can do and what I, how good my computers are that I build. And so I would kindly like to issue this challenge. All right. I guarantee you without a shadow of a doubt. Because I've told my dad and I've told my siblings and I've spoken with such confidence for so long. And I know without a solid or without a, without a doubt in my mind or without a doubt in my heart. That if I took the college graduation exam for just building a computer, if a college course gave me the required money right now and told me, if you build a computer that we have given you the budget for, then you pass the class and we will give you a degree in full right now. All right. I could do that. You know why? Because I have confidence because I've went through hardship left and right to earn my knowledge, to get my skill. I've had to go through the hardest hardship you guys could ever hope of. I've had to learn through trial and error. Is it not? Is it fun? God, no. Trial and error is not fun, and it's not cheap. But, you know, trial and error is honestly probably one of the best teachers on this planet that you will ever have, even if it's not fun going through those trial and errors. But, you know, one thing I can state is I know I could pass the college course if they just told me, we will give you the money, we won't charge you for this class, but we will just make, or if you will just give you the money, and if you can pass with the budget we've given you and no more, or even if you can stay under the budget and not go, and not go above it and build an entire gaming streaming computer within the means that we give you, then we will get we will give you your degree and you can graduate. I have no doubt in my mind that I could do so easily, guys, because I have worked my butt off to get my skills and my knowledge. Do I have a degree now? No. But what I can tell you is I'm confident in what I do. All right, and I can tell you any computer I build will hands down be a hundredfold better than anything Walmart will sell you or anything Best Buy will sell you. You know why? Because everything on Best Buy's shelves, every desktop on Best Buy's shelves, or every desktop on Walmart shelves, or any other computer store shelves, only has part. They have parts in them. They may have GPUs. They may have RAM. Okay, but everything they sell is extremely old and or outdated. All right. They may be selling a computer that has a dang near six or year old plus GPU and they're overpricing it and price gouging the heck out of it, okay? Along with that dadgum computer. All right, so here's my point, folks. I could build you a better PC for probably like 1800 to two grand. If you guys give me a budget and issue me a challenge, and you guys are willing to work with me. I can prove what I can do. And I can show you what I am capable of. Okay? And I promise you, anything and everything that I build will run a heck of a lot faster than anything Walmart sells. Anything Best Buy sells or anything else you're going to buy at another computer store. Because here's the problem. Their computers do not have all-in-one local cooling systems in them. They come with a basic piece of crap, a piece of crap, piece of trash air cooler. The stock air cooler, which is not proper for a streamer and a gamer. 
that wants to game on some pretty good PC based games. Okay, you're never going to be able to run a lot of those games on the best settings possible. All right, so um, yeah, issue me a challenge. I issued this challenge to the investors out there. I would issue this challenge to any investor out there and tell you without a shadow of a doubt that I can guarantee you, okay, that if you challenge me to stay within the $1,800 to $2,000 budget to build you a desktop computer, I'll do so. And I guarantee you it will outperform anything that you've probably ran before. And maybe it depends. If you're rich, I probably won't be able to do that on a 2K budget. But if you've never owned a gaming or streaming desktop before, I can guarantee you that I can build one that will blow your mind out of the water. Um, but I can also tell you this now. Is you're only going to get what you pay for. So two grand... Yeah, I can build you a dang good computer with that. Sadly, two grand is barely covering the tower and the components in it, guys. Two grand it barely co can covers the tower and the things in it. So you got to realize, everything Walmart sells or everything Best Buy sells you, here's a little heads up. They are selling you an air-cooled stock-formed desktop with no good qualities about it. The same thing could be said about Best Buy. They may be giving you a mouse and a keyboard. They may be giving you a monitor. But here's the catch, guys. <laughs> They're selling you something so highly overpriced and price gouged. Like, seriously. I could build you with roughly exactly $2,500 to $2,800. I could build you. That's just the price for everything. Monitor, keyboard, mouse, everything in the computer. Roughly that covers pretty much shipping and handling. You might get a chair. I can't promise you it's going to be an LED chair because most LED chairs are about $300 because that was, that was an accessory that my brother Jeremy bought for himself. But what I'm saying, guys, is desks and chairs are accessories that normally come as extra. If you want them, they're extras. A monitor is supposed to be considered as an accessory. But Walmart sells them as a bundle. And then what you're not getting is the desktops they are selling are so outdated and old that those desktops probably barely realistically would sell for less than probably, what, five, six, seven hundred dollars $700? But they're charging you for everything. They're giving you all these products, and they're still charging you for them, but they're labeling them as a bundle. And they're probably charging you roughly anywhere from $1,200 to $1,600 for a piece of crap built desktop. And they label it. They label it as a gaming desktop because it has LEDs. But another, form fa or another factor here is it doesn't have a little liquid cooling. It doesn't have good um it doesn't have good settings within the bios the bios are not tuned to a correct form to give you the best settings and the best overclock for uh all right so if you if you run your computer case fans at a lower speed and you have your in your bios a proper setting set you can run your BIOS with your fans. You can configure your fans and run your fan settings at a really eh, about anywhere from roughly five, six hundred to maybe eight hundred fifty at most. Okay, that's at full blow. Eight fifty at full throttle. Okay, that's most fans is what I do. I never put my fans any higher than eight fifty. There's no need for it. I have so many fans in my desktop, guys, because I have six on my four twenty all in one local cooler. Um. And then I have two on my GPU, or no, three on my GPU, which is a given. And then I have three on the bottom of my computer tower, three or two or three on top, and then I have one on the back, okay? So three, six, that's seven in the case alone. Then you get the three on the GPU, then you get the six on the all-in-one local cooler. I have a push-pull configuration on my local cooler, okay, guys? So that means I got one, I got the liquid cooler pulling air in from the front. All right. 
Oh, let me make sure I got that configured out right and wording that correct. Sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, so pulling it in, I've got the part pulling in from the front, and then the back fans on the liquid cooler are pushing the air out of the radiator towards the push-pull. Pulls in from the front, and then the back of the radiator, radiator fans pushes the air out, pretty much. Um... So what I'm trying to tell you guys is I can overclock my entire computer and I can run every game that I own on Ultra or Extreme Graphics. I can do it on freaking Call of Duty, guys, still, without an issue with the 3060 GPU, okay? I never really struggle. So what does that tell you guys? I know what I'm doing know exactly what the heck I'm doing. So I got a challenge to investors out there. I challenge any and all investors who are willing to take a chance with me and allow me a chance at one of my goals and dreams. And I don't have many, but I have a few. If you issue me this challenge and cooperate with me and work with me, I promise you I can build a computer just as good as mine, if not better. Because my case is a closed case. And later on down the road, I have goals of building my wife first a computer. And then I'm going to upgrade my case and um, do something with my case. I've yet to figure out if I'm going to keep my computer the way it is or if I'm just going to build an entire another computer. I don't know right now, guys. But my goal is, guys, is I'm seeking investors. I'm wanting to do this. This is something I desire. I've got a name. I'm not going to speak it out loud because that could be detrimental, and I don't want my name sto stolen, okay? Um, I've got to go get it copyrighted and patented and everything else, and I have to go put it into papers. It would cost me $100 to get it put into papers, and I'd have to go to the courthouse to do that. And so the reason why I want to do this, guys, is because, well, this is something I'd like to do. And so I'm seeking and then challenging any rich investors out there who are willing to take a chance and someone who actually loves computers. Computers are something he enjoys. Now, I'm not going to dog on you if you love your consoles. You guys play your consoles. I don't really care. You guys are more entitled to that. But I, I love my PCs. I love my desktops. I'm not going to give people crap about their console devices. Um... But I want to be able to build desktops that are worth their money, worth the price that people are paying. And I want to be able to give people something they can enjoy. All right? Or maybe not give it, but you get my point. I want to sell something to someone that when they play on it and when they game on it, anytime they may come back to me, for repairs or diagnostics or something like that, I can try my best to diagnose the problem and to figure out the issue, okay? And I'm going to have to go about getting tools and stuff too for all that because I don't have that. But you guys, you guys got to realize that this is, I want to be able to hear my, my, uh, what's the word? I want to hear those who are willing to buy my products tell me how much they enjoy them. I want to hear how much they love gaming on them, how well they're working for them. That, to me, means the world. All right, do I, would I like to be able to make an income off of what I'm doing? Yes. Would I like to be able to make an inco income off of this? Yes. But I also need people who are willing to help me. I'm not the brightest tool in the shed. That's why I'm going to have to require help from family and people I know, people I trust. But I also am asking and challenging investors to please Give me a chance. Right now, you can just call me Samson of Old or Austin. Later on, when I get a little bit more finances on my end, guys, I have Austin's my M on a disability check. I will actually make an effort to go get that, that paperwork signed at the courthouse, okay? So that way, we have that in legal writings, and I will have an actual name to give you guys. I'll have to ask my dad what that name was again. I think I remember it, but just to be clear, I want to make sure I'm remembering it, you know? So anyhow, guys, thank you. These are things I can do. Like I said, if you guys wanted an LED case, if you guys wanted a glass panel case, I could build you guys literally. I don't know how to word this, guys. If I had the budget, 
I don't think you guys realize what I could do with computers. If I had the budget financially, I don't think what you guys realize I could do for myself and my wife. So imagine what I could do. Imagine. Just think about that, what I could do if I had the finances and the budget to logically configure and put together a PC that would make me happy. And if it makes me happy, then I know it'll make you happy. Okay? So I've always told people, and I've told my brother in Christ, Jeremy, you only get what you pay for. But also, if you want something done right, come to me. I'll do it. And I'll get it done. And I'll get it done right. Okay, guys? I am one man. I am one person. My wife helps me with what I do. Guys, when she's free and when she's able, I don't have any hands to help me. I do this all by hand because I love and enjoy this. But this is what I'm asking is for help from others. This, my name again is Samson of Old or Austin. So I will put my camera up just so you guys get the gist of it. And I would very kindly like to ask for people. Well, no, I ain't got a camera anymore. That's right. I took my camera off. Sorry, guys. Well, anyhow. Um, I have plenty of videos with my face up, so thank you again. God bless you guys, and until, um, what I do? Until tomorrow, I guess, all right? So peace out, fam. If you guys really want a computer built right, though, come to me, I'll get it done. And I give you my word on that, but remember... You get what you pay for. So if you guys want a piece of crap, garbage, six, seven, eight hundred dollar desktop, that's what you'll get, especially if you want it done fast and you ain't going to give me time to work with it. If you guys actually want your money's worth and you want something that's worthwhile and good and you want a perfect system, then you guys will work with me and give me time. Let me get everything done the correct way. GPU, installations, updates, upgrades, everything. Kit and caboodle, everything. And I promise you, when you guys get it, you'll be more than happy with your product. And that much, I, Samson of Old, or Austin, can promise you. God bless and peace out, fam.